buzzing and you're going to be buzzing because it's time for Soccer AM Pro Am. And it's live. In the area. Thanks, Bears. Yes, we are buzzing. 1990 vibes in the area. Time for some skills, frills, and penalty takes. That don't Pro Am. Do you not get that? That don't go, John. No. Phil Stills, belly aches. Please. No, Sorry. it's bad, Ryan. Monday's fans get it. Uh, it's where the aim of the game is to win some cash by fusing football knowledge and footballing ability. Let's meet the band. Our front man is today's pro. We wrote for luck. They sent us Crawley Town's Mark Wright. And our rhythm section, a.k.a. our amateurs, it's Ray and Bess. Yeah. Love it. Unfortunately, we still don't have any fans. You've got no fans! All right, Raider. Uh, so, uh, as we're joined by the man who can pretty much do everything, we've asked Mark to double up. So, Mark, I don't want to do this, is going to be answering questions and booting balls. Is that OK? I'm all good. I'm just buzzing. I've, I've been called the pro. Yeah. Well, I used to be that side. <laughs> I'm loving it. Uh, right, each time Mark gets a question right, he'll step up. However, if he answers incorrectly, then it will be Ray or Bez's chances to step up or step on. <laughs> OK, there are five challenges to complete. Each one's worth £50. Get a top bid at any stage and your final price pot will be double, doubled. With today's winnings going to a charity of your choice, Bez, which is... What's that, Sonny? What's the charity of uh, your choice? Oh, yeah, mate? Coffee for Craig. Coffee for Almost Craig. charity, Manchester. Almost. Nice, Craig, love it. Yeah. Excellent, right. Nice start. Here's Jim with the rules of the regs. Stop is a penalty, and you need to bag it. Next, a sweet volley gets a lolly. Hammer time. <laughs> you can't touch this. <laughs> then, it's a 1v1. Do what you want, but you've got to go past the PK spot. <laughs> Next up, the challenge is to hit the crossbar. As you like it, it's simple. Get for all of that, and you get the chance to wrap it up with a free kick. Pro Am completed it, mate. Yeah, the bully, there he is, looking resplendent in his, his, pleather, his pleather jacket. Uh, he's a referee today. Oh, nice, Jim. He's a referee today. Respect him at all times if, if, you, if you can. It's tricky sometimes. Uh, right, um, here we go. In the sticks today, it's hashtag Immy. Yes, Jim! Uh, before we kick things off, who would like to have a little look at that? That oh, is the new freshmen's. Nike Flight Premier League ball. It was used for the first time in last night's Friday Night Football, and it's the official Premier League ball for the remainder of the season. Its design is a nod to the classic Total 90 era, which was used in the Premier League between like 2004 that? and 2008. Oh. Smells like football. Uh, there you go. <laughs> Lovely stuff. Right, you've got five minutes to complete all five challenges, and you know your time is up, Mark. When you hear this sound. Usher in a competition of most flips of a pancake. <laughs> <laughs> how, many did you, how many did you do? I did about 16, I think. 16? <laughs> yes. Wow. I could have gone all day. Yeah. That would have been right, laugh. Uh, Ray, Bez, Mark, are you ready? Come on, yeah. here we go. Let's play. Soccer AM Pro Am. OK, here we go. Question number one. Thierry Henry. Thierry was linked with becoming the manager of which championship club this week? Bournemouth. Bournemouth, correct answer. You're up. Right, staff, first up to penalty, mate. Safety or top bid? Oh, this Lovely back. stuff. Right, Lovely team. stuff. Some yips. Get from I'm out another week. <laughs> Take it oh. easy. Who became the youngest ever player to ever start in a Champions League knockout match after being named to face Sevilla on Wednesday night. Who became the youngest English player to ever start in a Champions League knockout match after being named to face Sevilla on Wednesday night? Ah, oh, no, I can't think. Is it Jude something? It is Jude something, yeah. Jude Bellingham. Jude Bellingham is the correct oh, answer. That's right. Buddy Ollie off the trampoline, mate. Watch yourself. Oh, oh, oh love it. You sure you're a left-back, son? Take us, son, take us. I mean, see, I mean, now, he's, now he's a pro, he's not celebrating. It's like, that's what I'm doing here. I mean, I'm here to in with a yeah. oh, That's what I'm about. <laughs> when a player kicks the ball to a teammate whilst looking the other way, it's called a no-look... Pass, disguise? 
What was your first answer? Pass. No, I'm sorry. Uh, no, I'll, 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 yeah, I'm going to have to press you for an answer. It's a joke. <laughs> They've got it. Got it wrong, basically. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> it's, one it's a one v one. You've got to take it past the penalty spot and try and score. The ball's right there, me old mate. Come on, Chris. <laughs> <laughs> oh. 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 <laughs> and he took the game out. Uh. <laughs> Big first touch there, Jim. <laughs> Big, <laughs> Big first touch there, yeah, Jim. Love it. He's an okay, uh, which League One club was subject to a takeover this weekend? Sunderland. Sunderland, correct answer. Well done. Right, so you're up 1v1, mate. When you like. Come and write stuff. Go on, right, so. Those bleed for righty. Never, oh, oh I say. He's taking liberties. He's, he's taking liberties. He's going for the clean hey, sweep here. Come and smash him. Uh, Celtic's Odson Edward is the top goal scorer in the SPFL, but what nationality is he? Say so the, the name again. Odson Edward. Edward. Dutch or French? D Dutch. Said, no, he's not. He's, he's French, but you got, you, you, I've got to take Dutch. I have to take Dutch. It's the wrong answer. Crossbar. Crossbar. You've got to try from here. Yeah, it's an hardest one. Crossbar. Up high. Bit of a run up. Shellsville. Tommy Topan. I love it. I love it. <laughs> uh, which Manchester United legend joined Instagram this week and already has over one million followers? Love it, Ray. Ray Keane is the correct answer. Come on, Wrighty. Four in a row. What is it, crossbar? Yeah, mate. Oh, ah. whoa. Mingo. Do you know how many he's following? A uh, million, isn't it? No, do you know how many he's following, though? No, zero, probably. No, yeah. Okay, that's, yeah. right. that's right. Uh, which Dutch Arsenal forward is the current top goal scorer in the WSL? Ooh. Hang on, I don't know. It's Vivian Medima with 12. Oh, go on to best crossbar, mate. Let's go. Oh. 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 Bottom bar. Bottom bar. <laughs> Uh, which two West Ham players had a debate about the taking of a penalty last week? Rice and Lingard. Rice and Lingard, correct answer. Come on, then, Wrighty. Let's go. Crossbar right, it is. Oh, it's ain't easy, this one. Oh, oh my God. God. How close was it? We're talking that. We're talking that. OK, since Jurgen Klopp took charge of Liverpool, they've registered more clean sheets in the Champions League than any other team. Who did their most recent clean sheet come against? In the Champions League? Yeah. I can't even think. Pass if you don't know. Pass. It's RB Leipzig. Come on, Ray. Try your best, love. Oh. Come on, Ray. Just chip it. Just, just like this. Yes, yeah. go. Let's go, Ray. Oh, Sabuio. <laughs> Sabuio. <laughs> Thomas Tuchel was manager of which club before Chelsea? PSG. PSG, pass your man. Off you go. Yeah. Come on, Ray. You got this. Too many questions. Which footballer became the first person to hit 500 million followers combined on social media this week? Cristiano Ronaldo. Cristiano Ronaldo. Ah, yeah, what a player he was. Come right, 20 seconds. Yes. Yeah. Oh, yes. yes! OK, with 24 goals, who is the top scorer in the championship so far this season? Ah! Uh, ah! Uh. Have a guess. Oh, oh, I don't know, don't know. Go quick, so I can have another go on a free kick. Ivan Tony. Take your time, Bez. Take, take your time. This is a free kick, mate. I'll tell you what. Oh, effort. Funny pitch, weren't it? OK. Good stuff. Well done, everybody. We've backed £200 there for uh, Craig. Is it Craig? Craig's coffee, is it, Bez? Craig for Craig's coffee. We've got £200 there, but we can double that up. All right. One more question, followed by one more penalty. If that penalty is scored, you will double your cash. However, if you miss, you'll go home uh, empty-handed and empty, uh, broken-hearted. Um, so, uh, are you, what are you going to do? Are you going to gamble? Gamble! You want me to, you want me to gamble, Bez? Gamble, yeah. Yeah. Go on, Let's go. Let's OK, go. we're doing it. All right. Here is your double or quits question. Liverpool host Everton in the Merseyside derby later today, live on Sky Sports. But who scored more league goals in their playing career? Was it Jurgen Klopp or was it Carlo Ancelotti? Oh, what a That's question. That's a good question, that. That's a good question. It's going to be a guess. Uh, Klopp was... Uh, he, he played 
right back, and I think he also was a striker at one point in his career. Uh, come on, someone give it this Crane's coffee. I'm going to go, because just because I'm just going to guess, and he's in my head, Jurgen Klopp. OK. Carlo Ancelotti scored 35 goals. Jurgen Klopp, 52. Yes. It's right yes. So you're up. Come on, right. Yes. Right oh, Use that ball. Use that ball. Use that new ball. Use a new one. Oh, do you want a new one? Go on yeah, in. Put that one. Is it double-double if it's top bin? Yeah. Yeah, it's for £400. If it got, but it has to stay in the top bins, right? Has if I missed, we lose the money. Yeah. Absolutely. So I'll I'll like it comes out of your pocket. I'll go safety. I'll go safety. Yeah, he's put it away. Let's 